Hey guys, Derek Allen here for selfmadeceo.co and today we're going to be reviewing a product called Tube Scout. Now Tube Scout is a product by Seth Bias and uh, a lot of people know him as the beast if you're familiar with him at all and he has released this simple super simple video tool and actually what it is it's a uh, Google Chrome extension so it's super lightweight very very easy to install uh, you get it you get the the code that they give you and you actually have to put it into another Chrome extension called uh, what is this called uh, tamper monkey and you just paste the code right on in there and it's working as soon as you get to YouTube and you visit a page you do a search you see this little number one pop up you know it's working now my first thoughts of this plugin or extension were kind of like this seems too simple right but the more I played with it the more the simplicity started to make sense because a lot of people they they create these plugins they create these extensions and they they just want them to be incredibly feature rich and just sort of complex just so they can charge a higher price tag so what, what I like about this is tube scouts the simplicity because with the simplicity means it's just giving you what you need and nothing else so even though there's not a ton of bells and whistles I'm still very satisfied with what I've seen now what I'm gonna do is just, I'm, I'm gonna kinda run through this and just tell you what it is so that way you can uh, come and make a decision alright so what we've done is we've done a search on YouTube and Tube Scout has done its job alright now what you're gonna see over here on the left hand side are a couple different things you're gonna see some interesting things all right, number one being rank difficulty. Now they tell you that anything I think under a thousand is going to be fairly easy to rank for. Here you see that I have 34. Now the reason I have 34 here, I think, is one of I guess three reasons. Number one, it's not a very popular keyword, so it doesn't have a lot of search volume. Um, number two, it's just not a topic that people are interested in or number three it's just kind of under the radar I'm hoping it's it's number three because I'm actually in the paleo niche and that's why I did this search so to have 34 is kind of kind of crazy right so I think this is something I'm gonna pursue because this is telling me it's gonna be pretty easy to rank for um, and as we can see the videos have the views 50,000 views uh, 317 views yesterday and this is something I really like about this plugin or this extension as well is it actually tells you how many video views each particular video got um, the day before so if I come back tomorrow it'll tell me what it got today um, so on and so forth so let's get that plugin back working just give it a quick second here there we go alright and then it says it gives you a seven day value as well so it's got over 1800 views in the last seven days now what you're gonna see with this and I'll tell you what this means in just a second is is you're gonna see each video it displays the views that it had but what you're gonna see is something interesting as you get closer to the bottom the views kinda of drop off except for you'll find some like some down here towards the bottom with 589 views now I've got a couple theories on why this is alright either these videos are using tags and they're showing up in related videos and they're getting those views or it's embeds but either way this shows me that the videos or the topic is interesting enough for people to be viewing it at this volume on a daily basis especially for videos that are two years old and the video is interesting enough so what that tells me is I could take this video because people are clear, clearly watching it make something very similar to this except add my own call to action so that's what this is telling me and I really like that and this kind of sep separates itself Tube Scout separates itself from other options because it does have this handy little feature right here which tells me people are interested in it people like this particular video and maybe I should make one like it now if we go back over here what you're gonna see is a couple of different things you're gonna be able to see get title which is something you can copy to clipboard and put it in your project and the reason this is cool is because you can start to see similarities on why these videos are actually ranking okay because a title in a video has a lot to do with it so if we start to see similarities we can start to craft our own title based on what we see here 
and the keywords and the structures and how many times they're putting the keyword that they're ranking for here and and that sort of thing okay so that's pretty cool but if we go down here and get title plus data we can also copy this to clipboard it's going to give us all that information plus it's going to sort it sort of by views or you can sort it by views in the last day or last seven days so that'll kind of tell you what kind of urgency you need to put on the title of your video to make this get similar results and then down here we have get tags which if you click this it's gonna go through all these videos and get all the similar tags so tags are important because if you put the same tags in your video as in some of these you can show up as related videos to these to these particular videos which means you don't even have to rank and so that that means you're gonna show up on the right hand side in related videos and as soon as the video is done you're gonna show up as related videos and that so if you use the same tags that they're using it's gonna tell YouTube this is what I want to rank for and this is what I want to show up for okay so you can see all the tags right here just by you know getting the tags and then uh, displaying the tags so that's pretty cool um, but then you can also go here and get data which again this is going to show you a bunch of other things too like the video link so if you wanted to make something similar um, the titles that you can sort of model your title after uh, the views and that sort of thing and then what I, th I think is really cool is you can view all the tags here but what I think is really cool and what kind of separates Tube Scout apart is you can get a list of the tags right but then you can start to see which videos have the same tags so like it says here crock pot one that means video number one has that keyword but video number one also has crock pot but video 7 8 10 and 11 also have that same keyword so what that's going to be able to do is if you start putting in these same keywords here, again, you're going to show up on the related videos and you're also telling YouTube what you want to rank for. So that's pretty cool. And again, all this is in the tutorial video for Tube Scout. just want to kind of give you my point of view on things since I've played with every, almost every single video marketing tool there is on the market. And I think that the simplicity of this one is what really set, separates itself because it tells you what you need to know and nothing else and it puts it in terms that anybody can understand alright so let's just look real quick we already did display tags we already talked about the views and that's kind of I mean look again there's not a lot of bells and whistles but this tells you the data that you need to know in order to rank a video it's incredibly simple and there's not a lot of confusing words and, and things like this like look this is vid IQ but over here we have the engagement rate discovered engagements as a, a percentage of total views like what does that even mean if I was somebody who just walked in here like I'd have to go and learn about what engagement rate is according to vidIQ and all this other stuff but with tube scout it just tells me look here's the important thing this video got 65 views yesterday so if you rank a video here there's a good chance that you can get 65 views so what could you do with 65 additional views for one video every single day do you think that you'd be able to get some passive email opt-ins or some passive sales with that you absolutely could and I can tell you from experience so look depending on where you're watching this if you're on YouTube right now what I want you to do is click the link in the description that's gonna take you to my site it's going to give you the full review, my full thoughts. It's also going to give you some insights that will make you think and some ways that you can actually use this Tube Scout tool. As well as you'll be able to see my bonuses, which are limited to 50. And you're not going to want to miss out on these bonus bonuses because I'm revealing some, some really awesome stuff that's going to amp the effectiveness of this tool up and your video marketing game as a whole. All right, I'm going to show you how to get people to actually embed your video on their site some of the biggest players for nothing it's not gonna cost you any money you don't have to pay them to put it there and if you're already on my site then what I'd like for you to do is just go ahead and scroll down again take a look at all of my thoughts everything that's listed below and check out the bonuses and if you like this and you want to get in then make sure that you're gonna be one of the first 50 to get it because I'm limiting my bonus to 50 people only just because of the nature that I'm showing you in that bonus could actually be used for good or evil depending on you know what you want to do so that's it for me thank you for taking the time to watch this video and I will talk to you later